Okay, so a little update, a little update I have for you and I am pretty shocked about because this should have happened in April instead of October. So, um, yeah, I have to go for a psychiat psychiatric evaluation i can't fucking say it <laughs> a psychiatric a psych oh my god a psychiatric evaluation and a drug test for um these occupational health doctors to like look at and take a look at me to see if i'm in the a right frame of mind I don't have a clue what this evaluation is like gonna be about. Or, like I, I asked him, why do you think I'm mental? I've just got a disability, Jesus Christ, and this should have been done in April. So they've um been backlogged six months. So um yeah. I'm just shocked at the DVLA. Um is doing this um i have to go on the 9th of october to get this psychiatric i can't say it comment below <laughs> comment below on how much i'm like <laughs> and how much i am like oh, i don't i don't know <laughs> i can't hardly fucking speak english so how the fuck am i going to talk to these fucking occupational health people that are there for your brain <laughs> i don't know but like um yeah this should have been done in april this shouldn't be happening in october i should have already had my car by june but no thanks to the dvla um thinking that i'm not fit for their road um standards whenever i checked out their website and their road standards is only if you've got epilepsy vertigo or um stuff that makes you really sleepy like just certain stuff going on with the brain you know what I mean? And I have nothing of that. I got the all clear of everything a year ago nearly in November. No, a year ago there passed in August. I got the all clear. So altogether this driving license thing is taking nearly two years on the end of January. That'll be two years. So yeah, um... That's my update. I'm sorry I haven't been making videos. I've just been like focusing on life and trying to get my mind in a right healthy way because um, I've just been sitting in the house doing nothing thanks to the DVLA. My head's been going crazy sitting in this house doing nothing. So I've started actually working out and my head actually feels a lot better but I've got clicky hips so um I had to cut out a few breaks um not a few breaks a few exercises that I couldn't do like the re leg raises and stuff like that my clicky hips is like done <laughs> doing them so yeah just thought I would give you an update on my license situation um i have to go for a drug test i think they said some kind of tests and it obviously is drug tests because they've um banned me from driving because i was smoking cannabis so um yeah it's obviously a drug test which i'm going to pass anyway and um a psychiatric um evaluation <laughs> If I said it right there. <laughs> um, yeah, so that's coming up on the um, 9th of October. And then I've got a letter there um, saying that.
that I have to go for my bone juice on the 28th of October. So yeah, I need my car. So this psychiatric evaluation, I'm trying to say it quicker so I can't mix it up or like, you know what I mean? <laughs> um, yeah, um, a psychiatric um, evaluation and a drug test will be happening in the next two weeks. So hopefully um, they'll see that my brain is all right. I just, I can't speak much English. <laughs> I can't speak the big words in English. <laughs> and um, I pass my drug test and they'll see that I haven't been lying to them. Um, they'll see that I, I need my car just for the basic needs of going to the shop in winter time um, with um, the walkways going to be iced over and stuff like that. I can't go out whenever it's icy, so I need my car. Um, yeah, so wish me luck. <laughs> and I'm so sorry. I, like, my English is like so bad. Seasons coming off the drugs. I've had to learn how to talk again, learn how to um, work my brain again. Um, but yeah, it's all good. I'm fin I, I keep going. There we go. It's all good. Thumbs up. It's all good. I'm going to, um, I'm going to pass this drug test. I'm going to pass this mental test. I'll just call it a mental test. <laughs> um, and Hopefully, I'll have a car by November. Fingers crossed. Peace out. Thank you for even being here and taking the time. And I've still not fixed the clock and I've like 10,000 batteries in there. <laughs> I'm scared to tip the clock down in case there's a spider in there. Because my house has been getting overrun by these massive big ass spiders. Hind it green. And one jumped on Green's nose. And Green tried to eat it and bit its leg off, but it was still going for Green. <laughs> so I, I killed it. I blew it up. I blew it up by um, my body spraying a lighter. <laughs> I just hate spiders. But yes, I think I'm a wee bit psycho because they say you're a bit psycho if you leave things wonky and um, time things like that there. But yeah, I'm okay. It's just... I'm just like, I just, like these DVLA people should have had this here sorted in April for me to take the drug test and psychiatric evaluation um, in April instead of October. So I'm going to, I'm going to complain a lot about that. I'm going to go to my solicitor and tell them what's happening too. They're wanting to take this to court. They think I've got a case against the DVLA because they didn't get, they didn't have a drug test to go to stop me from driving, if you know what I mean. They didn't have like any blood tests done, piss tests done. They didn't have any drug tests done on um on me to stop me from driving, um. They just, I don't know what happened. Somebody out there is tightening and I think I know who. So Carmen's a bitch. But anyway, yeah, peace out. <laughs>